welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys a really unique, really innovative, brand new piece of equipment. And when I say brand new, I mean brand new. I'm going to be giving you guys the full rundown of the Depal Sports D1 4-in-1 fitness machine that just hit the market. This machine is 4-in-1. What that means is it is at once a treadmill, an ab roller, a rowing machine, and a strength station. When I first heard of this machine, I was a bit skeptical, wasn't sure how it could be all of these four things at once, but it really is. It's the ultimate home gym, and I'm gonna be showing you guys how it all works. But first up, unboxing. So given that this machine has so many functions, it does come in kind of a large package, but it's actually really, really easy to set up. The machine comes fully set up right out of the box, and the only additional items are an instruction manual, and a few add-on pieces that you can use depending on the exercise you're performing, which I'll demonstrate shortly. Okay, so first impressions. When I first unboxed this machine, I was honestly just so impressed by the design. I could not believe that Depal Sports came up with a way to incorporate all of these workout functions into just one machine, and the machine can even handle a weight capacity of over 300 pounds. The design itself is super sleek, as you guys saw, so it actually does fit great in any room, even my New York City apartment, and it's actually pretty flat, so I think it could fit under a lot of pieces of equipment, like your bed, your couch, what have you. I was also just so impressed that there was not a single thing that I had to do to set it up. Like, I would absolutely run you through the setup process, but it was literally just me lifting the machine out of the box, and that was it. But anyways, I want to get to the most important part of this video. I want to show you guys all of the things that you can do with this machine. Like I said before, there are four specific functions, the treadmill, the ab roller, the rowing machine, and the strength station. Adjusting between all these settings is super simple. All you have to do is adjust a few parts of the machine itself, which I'm going to demonstrate to you right now. First up, the treadmill. From the starting position, you're going to loosen the screws under the seat cushion. And then you're going to lift up from the handlebars of the machine until it's fully upright. Then you'll just tighten the screws again to lock in this position. You can also easily adjust the handlebars using the back screw near the display panel. And that's it. To start running, all you have to do is turn on the power, which is at the front of the machine. And then you're just going to put your safety clip in place and press the start button on the display. When you're running, you'll see this clear large display screen in front of you that toggles between speed, time, distance, and calories burned. You've also got your plus minus buttons to control the speed, and there are also handy preset speed buttons at 3, 6, 9, and 12 kilometers per hour. And one more feature that's particularly unique about this machine, it actually comes with a built-in speaker, so you can connect your phone using Bluetooth and just start playing your jams. Lastly, I wanted to show you all the look and sound of the machine at max speed. Here I am running at 12 kilometers per hour. And if you're running really fast and something happens, when the safety clip gets pulled, the treadmill will automatically come to a stop. Okay, so that was just workout function number one, the treadmill, and now we have number two, the ab roller. To adjust the machine from the treadmill to the ab roller function, you're going to loosen these screws on the outside legs, both sides, and then slide down the leg into the next setting. Then you're going to tighten the screws to lock into position. We're also going to push the handlebars back, again just by pulling out that screw at the back of the display screen, and then you're all set up. Now you'll just carefully get on the machine and start engaging that core. And now to adjust the machine to the third function, the rowing machine setting, we're going to move it back up to the fully upright position by loosening those outside leg screws and pulling up, and then you're going to tighten the screws again. And then you're actually also going to loosen those two screws under the seat cushion to push the machine back down to flat. Again, tightening the screws back up afterwards. Next, all you have to do is hook on the handlebars to the front of the machine. To get started rowing, all you have to do is get into seated position and you'll see that there are straps already attached to the front of the machine for you to loop your feet into.
Now, the rowing machine also comes with its very own display. Here, you'll be able to adjust the resistance of the machine from a scale of 1 through 10, and it'll also show you the resistance level, number of reps, time elapsed, distance, and calories burned. Okay, now, last but not least, I want to show you guys a workout function number four, the strength station. So this part actually doesn't require any adjustment of the machine itself. You're just going to have to add on some of these pieces to the front of the machine. We have our waist belt here and two different handles. With just these three things, you can do a whole range of strength workouts, including bicep curls, single arm rows, pretty much any cable workout, and even enhanced squats. I feel like I could go on and on demonstrating more possible movements, but the main takeaway is that with all the things this machine can do, especially at the strength station, it offers way more than just four functional combinations. What's really great about the setup is that you can even work out with your friends and family. One person can use the train station and another can run on the treadmill. And when you're all done with your workout, there are front wheels on the machine so that you can roll it into a convenient place to store. Okay, I think I've covered just about everything now. I know this machine has a lot of functionality. So if you guys still have any questions, feel free to leave me a comment down below. My favorite thing about this machine, it has to be the fact that it is so easy to adjust between all the different functions it can do. I basically just tried out the machine two times before I fully got the hang of it and was able to adjust however I needed between my workout sets. Overall though, if you are thinking about starting a home gym or really considering more at home fitness options, this is the perfect piece of equipment for you. If you liked everything that you've seen and heard in this video, definitely check out DePau Sports, the D1 machine. It is linked in the description down below. And like I said before, if you have any other questions, feel free to leave me a comment. All right, thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you all next time.